Hello, River Heights. Hi, I'm Sydney. And I'm Grandma Carolyn, principal for the day. It's Thursday, October 9, 2014. Colts, do you have your student ID card? You need one? If you lost yours, we have a plan for you. Just go to the library. See our great librarian, Mrs. Donna, and she'll set you up with a new one. That's right. You have to pay for the replacement fee of $5, but you get it instantly, and then you can use it to get into the school dances, check out library books, and for after-school detention. Did you say after-school detention? What? Yes, why? Because after-school detention will be happening today in E103, right at 311 until 4 p.m. Use your student ID card to get credit for being there. Here's community news. There's a wheelchair basketball camp being held on Saturday, October 25th from 2 to 4 p.m. There's no fee and it's open to any and all athletes who use a wheelchair to learn the basics of basketball. Did we mention there's no fee? Where will it be? It will be held at Riley's Gym at 3900 Acacia Avenue in Norco. So spread the word. Also happening in community news, the Special Olympics World Games are coming to Los Angeles in 2015, and the city of Corona has been chosen as a host site for some of the events. There will be a kickoff event this Saturday, October 11th at 10.30 a.m. at the Farmer's Market located at 490 North Main Avenue, North Main Street in Corona. Our school district will be there helping out. Special guests at the kickoff event will be Nicole DeSalva, former two-time Olympian, actress Megan Holder, comedian Adam Rank, and Kid Rock Free Band. Who's got spirit out there? Well, if you do, wear it on your t-shirt, a Colt t-shirt, that is. Make sure you buy the newly redesigned Spirit Wear t-shirts. They're selling quick during both lunches on the lunch stage for only $15. Get yours so you can look swaggy on Fridays. In fact, this Friday, anyone who's wearing an RHIS Spirit shirt will be awarded hero points. I'm principal for a day, Grandma Carolyn, and I... My son, Michael Rosales, is a teacher, and this is my granddaughter, Sydney. It reminds me of when Michael was Sydney's age. He had a little trouble getting to class on time. Well, I talked to a couple of the teachers, and I decided um, I'd take some action. So Michael came out of his class, kind of nonchalant, and there I was. He was a little bit surprised to see me, and I told him, I'm walking you to your classroom. If I have to come back, next time I'm wearing my pajamas. Mom! He wasn't so uh, thrilled about that. He actually was on time then on. So thanks for letting me be here. I'm so honored to be here with you, Sydney. I love you. Thank you. I love you, too. Have a great day. We'll be right back. Did you walk to school yesterday during the International Walk to School Day? If so, thank you for participating and showing your support. Go Colts! Colts, Izzy here. There will be a car wash to raise funds for the funeral expenses of the of the four Roosevelt teens who lost their lives on October 3rd in a car crash. It will be held on Saturday, October 11th from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. in the student parking lot at Roosevelt High. There will also be a taco cart from 11 to 2 p.m. for lunch. All proceeds go to re directly to the families of the teens. Please go and support. And we're back. And it's that spooky time of year when your friends act a little weirder, homework gets scarier, lunch tastes a little more strange, and ASB spells, sells their spooky grams. Spooky grams are on sale right now at lunch. Let's check this out. Help! 
Oh, Sydney, what's wrong? I need help with my homework. Oh, okay, don't ask your dad. <laughs> Just go to the homework help every Monday starting right after school until 4 o'clock. Where? It's in room D102. Honor Society tutors will be there to help you on your homework. Or if you don't understand any of the classroom, any of your classwork, they'll help you with that too. Well, that's it for today, Colts. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.